bulking up is an epic example of no science, bro science. The physiological discord caused by bulking is dramatically opposite to rapid body remodeling and has no place in the enhancement of muscle appearance and performance. Awesome! Innovative dietary advice from a guy that looks like he survives on mostly human organs. You gotta be so good that they can't ignore you, especially the ones that ain't done shit for you. Yeah, you know exactly what I'm meaning. They stab you in the back and then they ask why you're bleeding. I don't trust words. I trust actions. I don't care what you heard. I'm not slacking. My name is Alan Roberts. This is Every Damn Day Fitness. Like, subscribe, the notification button over there. Share my videos. Also, over there is the join button for a price of a Dunkin' Donuts cup of coffee. For the month, you can get exclusive live videos. I'm going to do some workout videos. We do live at fives a couple times a week. Today, we're doing a happy hour live. We're going to have a few cocktails. Tyrone Roast coming just for the members only today. Have at it, Tyrone. How the fuck you been? So, for those of you right now that are upset with me, you know, insulting this guy with the human organ thing at the very beginning, I'm very fucking sorry, but he looks like a creepy ass motherfucker to me. It's my, in my opinion, of course, so if you don't like it, I'm sorry, fuck off, but that motherfucker looks like he is voted most likely to be the face you wake up when you're in a bathtub full of ice missing a kidney. Um, very fucking honestly, that is a creepy looking motherfucker and apparently completely fucking bonkers ass motherfucking crazy. Because in relative terms, he is discussing on his alternate uh, Instagram where he is selling his bang anti-diet energy book, whatever the fuck it is. He is talking about how bulking up is complete bro science and you can, and you can do all sorts of things and bulking is horrible. And I get it. Here's the thing. I don't even suggest that people actually bulk up. You can eat in a slight caloric excess to try to build some muscle mass or you can eat at maintenance and try to body recomp and everything like that. I get it. But he is a complete fucking whack nut who completely misrepresents a study uh, to try to make himself sound better. Amazingly, a 2014 study showed that test subjects who overfed on 800 protein calories per day did not show increases in body weight or body fat. Consequently, overfeeding does not automatically lead to weight or fat gain unless, of course, you're overfeeding on fats and carbohydrates. Now, since Hannibal the Cannibal over there did not list off the study that he's referring to to sell his book that says you can eat 800 calories more than caloric maintenance level and not gain weight... Um, me, not being a sciencey guy, reached out to a smart motherfucker, the nice bald man, James for Shredded Sports Science, to get the information I needed. And I do encourage that other YouTubers start doing shit like that because, uh, you know, that way you don't sound like a fucking idiot. The study that we came up with was this study, and it is based off of 30 fucking people for eight fucking weeks who ate 800 calories more if, in protein than uh, they overate by 800 calories in protein. The research article's name from 2014 is the effects of consuming a high protein diet on body composition in resistance trained individuals. Now, two things. First of all, since Mr. Jack Alwak did not actually list off the study, if this is not the study he's talking about, I invite him in between his servings of Chianti, Fava Beans, and Ray Liotta's brain to tell us which study he was actually talking about so he doesn't look like a complete fucking jackass. However, he looks like a complete jackass. This study is a piece of fucking garbage. The takeaways from the study are it was with 30 people who self-reported their nutrition and self-reported their resistance training done over eight weeks. This is the article that we believe he is using to refute all other science in order to sell his book. That's some shady-ass fucking shit, but from the other videos I'm seeing about Mr. Jack Alwick, um, I am pretty sure that that's his uh, modus operandi. So, uh, Jack, if you see this, please let us know which study it was. Um, please don't eat me. And that is just my two cents in the matter. My name is Alan Roberts. You can hit me up on Instagram at Alan Roberts. You can hit me up on Twitter at Every Day Fit. I'm also on Facebook at Every Day Fitness. And I'm on the internet at EveryDamnDayFitness.net. Goddamn.